The original Tomb Raider from 2001 starred Angelina Jolie. Mm -hmm. Remember that movie poster right there? How could I forget it? All right, put up the new one with Alicia Vikander looking equally as strong. Oh, Scott. strong. Yes, it's a good word to describe it. Well, now we hit the gym with her. She put in a whole lot of work and a whole lot of muscle in rebooting the Tomb Raider franchise. Woman of Steel, Alicia put her body through the paces with a grueling workout that transformed her into a lean, mean fighting machine for Tomb Raider. Even I can see it now. I was like, wow, I need to go back to the gym. I do not look like that anymore. But it was, yeah, it was some hard training to get there. It takes four months to get to that point of three weeks to just lose it all. We were in set for about 12 hours a day, and, and actually this, I mean, this is an added, 45 minutes in the morning, but it actually ends up giving me more energy throughout the day, so that's good. I'm a petite girl and I've always been, and I kind of wanted to feel what it would be like to try and get that kind of physique uh, that I aimed for with this part, because I loved story-wise that it was integrated, that she she trained, she was boxing or doing MMA, and she, she likes to bicycle, so it's plausible for her in the end to kind of start to become this heroine. And yeah, that's really the Oscar winner pulling off almost all that action. Determined she is, even as a little girl in Sweden, we showed Alicia this precious video. What should it be of day you want to be stole? I should be scored I thought I wanted to be like a singer or a florist or something when I was a kid. <laughs> And I actually say that you say you want I want to be, to be an, actress, an actress, and I actually had no clue that I wanted to be an actress. Look at my cheeks. <laughs> Cutie. <laughs> Eight-year-old Alicia took home the big prize that day. I don't know where that is, but it's pretty cool because it's like half my size back then. <laughs>